I'm going to show how to make a lock for a filing cabinet. Make sure you use a cabinet that is very well built. I bought this one at a surplus store. The first thing I did was choose a one inch square tubing for my bar. I then cut a heavy gauge pipe about two to three inches that will receive perfectly the square tubing. The pipe will need two bolts welded in line on one side. It's a good idea to choose heavy duty high quality steel bolts. This will ensure a strong weld. Next I will remove the bottom drawer on the filing cabinet and then lay it on its back. I then drilled two holes about a quarter of the way in from the edge on the base of the cabinet. The placement of these holes was measured by matching the bolts that were welded onto the sleeve. Secure the sleeve by using lock washers and nuts. Tighten well with a socket wrench. Now that the sleeve is secure, I will now make the latching mechanism for the top. I purchased a heavy duty hasp at a local hardware store. The loop of the hasp will be mounted at the top of the filing cabinet, directly in line with the sleeve that I just installed at the bottom. The loop hardware that I bought was a little too long, so I marked and cut to custom fit. I then removed the top drawer of the cabinet to make installing the loop easier. Using vice grips, I clamped the loop in place. At this point, I had an option. I could either drill holes and bolt it in place, or I could weld it in place. I decided it would be more secure if I would weld it. I then secured the hasp in a vise. Using a cutoff wheel on my grinder, I cut the hinge side off of the hasp, leaving the fastening plate. The fastening plate was then squared up on the end of the square tubing bar. It's important that the slot on the fastening plate is fully exposed and that the end of the bar does not overlap into it at all. I then welded it on all the way around. While the welds cooled, I returned the top drawer to the filing cabinet. The locking mechanism is now complete. Here's how it works. With the drawers shut, simply slide the bar into the sleeve at the bottom. Then, fasten the hasp over the loop and secure with a padlock. Whether you use filing cabinets for files, pictures, ammo, or tools, this lock will add extra security to your property.